Hey guys, so today me and my family went to Silverburn, which is like a mall near Glasgow, and we went to look for holiday stuff because we're going to Florida next month for my birthday, which is kind of kind of scary. Just the idea of me being 20. <sighs> um, so we went and we bought a whole load of stuff and I figured I would show you because uh, I see a whole load of these videos, I enjoy these types of videos and I think a lot of other people do so I wanted to make one. Um, and the first thing we got was kind of a shared thing between me and my sister so we could get both of them. I'll just show you. We got a black and a red set of tops, they're exactly the same. Um, and they were £8 each. They're just like a little net top and they're by Nella Fantasia but it's TK Maxx so who cares. Uh, they're pretty cute so these were awesome. So the second thing I got was this portable USB battery pack thing. Here's the packaging and this is it. It's a cute little purple thing and it matches my nails. Um, so a little keychain. I basically got this for going on holidays and when I'm working at the festival this year I usually have real problems with trying to find available sockets to charge my phone and stuff. So this basically, you charge it up and it will fully charge your phone if you need it to. So this is going to be like essential and it was pretty cheap, it was only £8. So it's pretty cool, it's cute and it feels pretty sturdy and everything so I don't think it's going to break when I'm there. But that's really cool. Okay, so the last thing I got from TK Maxx is this adorable pair of shoes. They were only sixteen ninety nine, and they're lovely. Um, I think they're real leather. They were marked down massively. Um, they're really cute, and they're similar to the shoes that everyone's kind of wearing with the spikes on them. So I figured I'd get these, and since I already have a whole ton of silver spikes. I just stick them on. We bought a whole load of spikes for my sister's dance display this year and we had a whole load left so I've actually made one of those spiked bras as well which I'm sure I'll show you in an outfit of the day at some point. Um, I've got some left over so I should have enough to put all over these shoes. Love them! Okay so another thing I got is this Eco Tools retractable uh, foundation brush. It's really cute. Um, I basically needed a foundation brush because my sister was getting one and my mum was like, do you want one as well? And I was like, yeah, sure, I'll have one. So now I have one. That is essentially how I have this. Um, so yeah, there's not much to say about that. Now I'm going to get onto the big thing that I got. Ta-da! Yes. I finally bought some MAC cosmetics. I'm so happy I'm no longer a MAC virgin. And the bag is so beautiful, I want to keep it forever. Um, so I'm going to show you what I got for the bag over there. Um, so the first thing I got, if I can open the packaging without ruining my nails any more than I have, um, the first thing I got was a Studio Sculpt SPS 15 foundation, which is this one. Uh, what we did was we went into the little uh, little Mac shop in Debenhams and Silverburn, and one of the girls there put the foundation on her faces and checked to make sure it matched. And I got this one because I have super dry skin. What with just having dry skin and having psoriasis and having all sorts of stuff like that. So this is uh, gel based or something apparently, so it's better. My sister got the actual um, plastic uh, tub thing. I don't know, it's a different one. But this is an NC15 and I didn't check, I don't know if this is the lightest one of this kind or not, but it's one of them. I was actually really worried in the shop that it was too dark because the lighting was pretty bad. But no, it's actually it's actually alright, I think. So I got that and I'm super happy because it was expensive as hell. Uh, but mum was nice enough to buy me and my sister 
both a foundation and she also got us both a blusher. This is in Full of Joy. And I'll show you that. I don't know how well it will show up, but it's like a kind of purpley thing. And the girl basically took one look at me and was like, you don't like conventional makeup, do you? And I was like, no, not really. She was like, you should try this one because it's like a light purple. Um, and I was like, yeah, sure. Um, I don't really... Well, actually, I always drop stuff on the floor, like, just there, but I don't really wear blushers, like, ever. In fact, I don't own a blusher. Well, I do now, but up until now, I haven't owned a blusher, so... This is pretty cool. I'm wearing the foundation and the blush right now. I don't know if you can see it. Um because the viewfinder in this camera is pretty bad um, but yeah it all feels really good on, it's pretty cool um, the packaging is beautiful and I'm really happy um, so yeah that is pretty much everything I got we went with the intention of getting a whole bunch of cloves for holidays and that didn't happen and my mum ended up spending £80 on makeup for the two of us we probably spent about £350 in total, so that's a secret dad doesn't know. But yeah, um, so that's everything that I got. Uh, I'm going to be making a whole ton of videos soon because college is nearly done and once all of the final work is finished, I'll actually have time to do stuff. So yeah, um, so until next time, bye bye.